Anyways, uh, hello. Welcome back to Landspare. <laughs> uh, what did I say last time that we were gonna do? We will dig, right? So that's happening. I've already- I've also- okay, yeah, so- <coughs> Christ. At the end of the last episode, I have, uh, <clears throat> oh, excuse me. I have set the path for, uh, for our digging future. And I've also set the, set the gathering zones. More or less. <clears throat> So for today, uh, we are going to start our one, two, three, four, one, one, two, three, four. <clears throat> We're gonna start our production of, uh, paper. Of the all-useful paper. that many millstones, but okay. Do I have a workshop for that? I don't think I do. <clears throat> I also need a... Uh, more bags. There's a lot of work that we have to do. <clears throat> so this will this will be a, a workshop for our sheep, so that we can get some yarn and stuff. It'd be great. What are you doing outside? <clears throat> we have so many doors now. It's great. be able to pick up some neat little things from the elven caravan, but probably not much. Okay, so we'll use the... <coughs> Basically, the food, the, not food, the paper production garden is more or less self-contained. Right, that way, uh, it's not really necessary, but it's... Makes for a good organization. <coughs> uh, what do I exactly trade with them, though? Hmm. Let's make a jeweler shop. Start cutting up, cut some jewels, <coughs> and then go from there. Hello there. Okay. Uh... 
Dig downstairs. Uh, J downstairs. Upstairs. Downstairs. There we go. Upstairs. <coughs> downstairs. Okay. So this is our cavern one, maybe. What's this? A Kraltha. <coughs> so if we were to make an access point from, okay. From the first cave level, then it would be uh, from that location. Zero days old. <laughs> Welcome. All things considered, the jeweler may not have, may not be able to do that much, but <clears throat> we'll try. We'll try. Okay. So that's done. Be nice if we had the slate to do that, but we don't, so... <clears throat> we'll just have to settle with uh, putting that there for now. What? Migrants? Okay. Minor. Legendary Furnace Operator. Christ. Woodcutter, Soap Maker, welcome to farming. Hope you like it here. An actual farmer, yay. A beekeeper. We should keep some bees. We really should keep some bees. Jeweler, farmer, okay. Trader, alright, you're kinda useless. <clears throat> I will have you earmarked for... Uh... For... Scribal work? For copying and stuff. A legendary gem setter. Wow. <clears throat> An actual doctor. A butcher who is a legendary tracker. Jesus Christ. Uh, you are a novice writer, you, but you are a legendary musician. <coughs> Because of course you are. Be a metalsmith. Another trader. Um, I have a manager. Be the second doctor on call. I don't know. <coughs> a herbalist was a legendary student. Cool. Animal caretaker, uh, going to woodworking, I suppose. Herbalist, who is a legendary student still. Wow. Very good students. We have some very good students. <coughs> I feel like they're shit at doing just about anything else, but, you know. Oh, 
Okay, now we're gonna make more slate. A ton of... <clears throat> ton of possible materials. Alright. Uh, BW, uh... Big M. I need mechanisms. <clears throat> Right, do we actually have any engineers outside of, uh... I don't care. I'll, I'll, be, I'll be destroying those later. Yeah, I don't think I have any engineers outside of the original crew, which is a bit of an... A bit of a miscalculation on my part. Giant louse. Christ, he punched out three of his legs. <clears throat> All right. Uh, well, I mean, we have the fields, but we don't necessarily have the. Oh, God. Punched his out, you punched out its tooth. Native platinum, expansive caverns. As far as I know, this is now we have now found the second cavern level. <clears throat> but given it's at a depth of like a hundred something, this might be cave eight, or sorry, cave three instead, simply by virtue of how low it is. Uh. Okay, that's fast. Alright, so what do you want? Probably a crafting workshop, which I somehow don't have. <clears throat> Alright, what do you got for me? Flying squirrels, giant flying squirrels, a rhinoceros. <laughs> Uh, leeches. Sure. I will take your rhinoceros. Okay, so I probably do need bones, yeah? Yeah. <coughs> do I have a butcher shop? I do not have a butcher shop. Uh, anyways, first let's build our farmer's workshop, and then let's build our butchers and tanners. Now it's obviously not permanent because it's outside, but you know. Okay. We can now pave this area off. Blocks, excellent. Millstones, all right. <coughs> yeah, 
And of course, the entire reason for putting it here is so that we can make good use of the water wheel. The Company of Drinks has many men and now requires a guild hall. Farmer's Guild. Alright, we can do that. So, the bigger question is, should guild halls be a part of the primary structure, or should they be by themselves? Probably primary structure, yeah? Slay the shit out of that mule, please. Okay, uh, this is an ocean, basically. This is an extremely useless Cavern 3, if you think about it. Oh, shoot. Because it's basically just a giant ocean. that needs to be moved around, huh? <coughs> Alright, we got power! Okay, uh... Work orders... Right, we can make cheese! That's a thing we're allowed to do. That is the thing we are allowed to do. Shear thread. Shear animal, spin thread. Milk animal. Make cheese. And, uh, whoops. <coughs> Make more buckets, because we might need them. So anyways, I'm thinking that um, the guild halls will essentially be like this section. We just extend downwards as far as we need to go. <laughs> Alright. Macadamia nuts. Ooh, sounds delicious. Orange wood earring. Okay. I'm pretty sure it's going to get moved into the finished stockpile anyway, so <clears throat> I don't have to worry too much about that. How much how much cloth clothing do I have? Uh C L O T A. Eh, all right. 
make some cloth bags. Like we're we're starting to really need those bags. <coughs> There we go. And this is just enough space for a Kraftstorf workshop dedicated to the amazing, amazing task of making paper. Also, we need some screw presses. And uh, check on our stockpiles to make sure that we are not getting any weird things like slurry. Paste I think is okay, right? Paste is okay. But slurry... <coughs> slurry is dedicated to the art of producing plant matter or paper matter and therefore... Okay. Well, uh, hmm. Mash plants the slurry, check seasonally. Uh, new order. Mill plants. Check seasonally. And then the last one, uh, well, it gets to do both, I guess. <coughs> okay, you, my friend, make choirs. <laughs> Yeah, we need some beds for these guys. And as well as some beds for our own dudes. Okay. Okay, so we finally found something hot. Upstairs... And then... There it is! Christ, that's deep. Um, alright, and this is like the... alright. Oh, cool. I was about to say, like, this is the only level, but obviously... Obviously not. Okay, so... This is... This is a good place. Basically, as close to a straight shot as we could possibly be. <laughs> yeah, like. The forge is so deep that there's not much... <clears throat> yeah, like, the entire thing is basically just one level. Well, it's not really true, but, you know. Oh, that's not gonna work, is it?
Like, this is about as much efficiency as I can eke out. <coughs> as I can eke out of this location. Uh, let's see here. Six will be for granite, and then... Seven will be for marble. Not because we need the marble, but because uh, we can use it to make some like neat looking statues and shit. And then eight is our forge. Okay. Alright, we're in good shape. We are in good, good shape. Cotton, huh? Jesus Christ, we need more of everything. <clears throat> Alright, well... In that case... We will expand this location. And use that as farmer's workshops. The workshops down. The goal of the workshops down here is to. Uh, oops. Uh, lavish meals. Make twenty-five once per season. <coughs> so the goal of the workshops down here is pretty simple, right? We. Jesus. You punched it so hard it instantly died. Wow. I'm impressed. I think we're out of barrels. Some wood barrels for us, thank you. Tear down these structures, we don't need them right now. Tear these down too. <clears throat> Why are y'all hungry? Go eat. They're, okay. They're foragers, they're kind of... Because they're very gung-ho about carrying things from A to B, they're kind of always hungry. I get it. <clears throat> I get it. We also need bags. We need so we need so much stuff to keep up with production. Okay, well. Tomatillo. What the hell is a tomatillo? <clears throat> yes, we have choirs now. Okay. Uh, making some executive decisions here. I'm going to turn this section into our
into our carpentry station. So all the carpenters will have their work and materials delivered to that location. Some minecarts to a stockpile. <coughs> well, maybe not. Okay. Cabinet goes behind, and then a container goes in front. There we go. Yay, more visitors. More visitors, come, come. Stay a while and listen. Slate. Never, never, never too little slate. Uh, rock blocks. Make that out of microline. Some tables. And some chairs. Wow, we're getting a lot of visitors now. To search for monsters, okay. So, hmm. We are at some... Wowza. We are on the map now, holy crap. I love it, I love it. For long term work, monsters to entertain people. We need a tavern keeper, which we do have. What are you doing? Woodworking? Okay, stop that. Or stop hauling. Stop hauling. Okay, so that's a petition. Jepum call natures. Hmm. Imam torch idols. Honestly, I don't really need y'all here. So you guys can go. Human dancer, human poet, uh, Sedaya Trusk Whisper. Completely dismayed. Elf dancer. Thief protected, and he's gone. Eddie, human poet. Honestly, I don't. I don't need anybody else, and they're all singing together. Human Lasher. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, where's my granite? Where's my trusty, trusty granite? There it is. Giant tick. Punch it! Like, 
you guys have been getting extremely good mileage out of just punching the things to death, so punch it. Sorry. Not like I dislike you guys, but... <clears throat> at, at the moment, I don't need, like, a giant amount of bars and shit. Shop out of microlene. We're getting more microlene. That's good. Uh, process plants. Do so seasonally. Thank you. Uh, slate. <laughs> yeah, not enough. Fine, Jesus. I wonder if these guys will be, uh... Oh, okay, he got into an argument after punching the tick to death in the door. Please get rid of it, thank you. Fine. Too many now, sorry. Hello, traders. Human caravan. Ooh, okay, good, 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 good. Like, human caravans are a source of books. The Company of Seasons, an herbalism guild. Huh. Company of Seasons needs an herbalism guild. Christ, you're just not a. You're not even. <laughs> <coughs> Why can't you just be happy with being a subsidiary of the Farmers Guild, huh? No. Alright, I've got a lot of yarn now, so. Lacking better options, we will put some clothing shops down here. <laughs> Pro 
process plants, do this forever. Cotton seeds. That's not ideal. That's not ideal, but we are growing like a metric ton of cotton, so it's not like it matters to me very much. <clears throat> Carambola, huh? Carambola wine? Is that just like normal wine, but with carambolas just like thrown in there? Actually, you know what? I'm going to set a food stockpile here precisely for uh, cotton and rope reeds. How was this organized? That way, uh, they won't have to carry all that resources all the way back down. Okay, uh, bag, yarn. Make all the bags, make all the bags, hurry. Okay, this is done too. Stairs. Oops. Uh, downstairs. Upstairs. There we go. Uh, rock blocks. We need more blocks. That was 12. And then rock doors. And then these will have to be made out of orthoclase for their magma defying tendencies <clears throat> okay and then one level above we will have uh, down here this will be our bar stockpile it's kind of a lower priority and then this will be our ore stockpile along with the uh, dolomite stockpile basically <clears throat> okay uh, we'll trash these I'm gonna have to ask you to uh, expedite these things because we do need to trade them out, trade them out as quickly as possible. <clears throat> so please hurry. Okay, microlink blocks are done. Sup? So, yeah, sure. It'll be a while before the caverns are open. I hope you're uh, okay with that. I mean, even if you're not okay with that, there's nothing you can do about it, so, you know. <clears throat> Jesus. If it's, a stock if it's a food stockpile, but it's not uh, built to take a specific kind of food, 
or a specific kind of plant, does that cause problems? Yeah. You're allowed to stay to eradicate monsters. We will open up the cavern level when we are prepared, which we are not at the moment because, as you can see, there's a lot of work going on. <laughs> <clears throat> So many visitors. I, I love having visitors. <clears throat> and uh, I may also want to... Whoops. Make a stone stockpile. Maybe not, maybe not this big. I mean, if you think about it, I don't really need to make it big at all. Barrows and then make some wooden mine carts. <clears throat> the goal is pretty simple, right? We will be using a quantum stockpile to uh, ensure that all of our rocks are in the same place. Alright, orthoclase doors are done. Hi. Yeah, sure, you may stay. If you intend to stay for the sake of eradicating monsters, you may, but as I've said before to the other guys, there's a little bit of work involved right now. Okay, let's trade. Uh, I will take your sterling silver, because I have use for that. Your raw crystals. And then... Oh, uh, a world of the keep, huh? The castle vault cobra. I don't have that much money, this thing is. So I cannot buy that many books. Record of the mountain halls, I'll take that. A world of the keep, I'll take that. And then take and search the truth. <coughs> and now we will make some bookcases. Uh, out of Willow. Do I actually put my uh, my library? Tis a silly question. We'll extend this out a bit further. What do I do about this weird section in the center, though? <laughs> um, I guess we could turn them into housing. Ish. Okay.
So this entire northern section will be used as our... Uh... As our... Library. It will be... Quite large. Perhaps this is a little too large. But we can always section off different areas for different purposes. <coughs> uh, chop down all the trees here, thank you. Blocks. Uh, granite blocks. Granite blocks. And granite blocks. All right. here is pretty simple, right? We're using this, uh, that intersection as... <coughs> a little character-specific housing, I guess. Everyone is so goddamn busy all the time. Lustful remembering talking with the spouse. Okay. We'll need some beds for those guys then. Alright. And now, just to uh, satisfy my own urges, please smooth the floor and uh, dump all this material so it's nice and clean. Magma smelter. Good old fashioned orthoclase. Maybe not necessarily good old fashioned, but. Anvil. And then uh, two kilns and two glass whoopsie daisies. I made a boo boo. <clears throat> I made a whoopsie daisies. <laughs> We have some lavish meals now, that's great. They're rotten, sadly, because we don't have enough storage. Uh, take specifically prepared food. <coughs> sure. Peppa. We, we, we bought the books that we needed, so nothing else matters. Radicating right, monsters, hello, welcome. Sheep yarn, so much yarn, so much cheese. Kinda need looms. <laughs> That's a little bit important. More 
barrels, more everything. Jesus Christ. Uh, I'm going to put a memorandum on slate construction for now. So that we can, like, all hands on deck finish this job. boys and girls. Oh wait, you know what? The doors that lead into ostensibly the entire reason why we're here should be special. That's why. Well, do what you can. What do you want? Diffin Pines filled. Human bod. Nope. Fuck off. <clears throat> Nothing against bards at this point. <laughs> but obviously, like we're the, we're dealing with we're dealing with some shit right now. Chain bent. I'm I'm I almost want to keep you. I'm gonna keep you around just because the name chain bent sounds really stupid. <clears throat> okay. Uh, please prioritize chopping on these trees as much as you are able. Thank you. will tell the the thing to stop <laughs> or rather like we need we need people to do <clears throat> work that's a little more you know that has a little more value behind it than just moving things from A to B We'll also need some more beds. Hmm. And I believe that can be arranged. Ish. Like, there's so much work that we have to do. Uh, 
might as well have this extend over into two different locations, just to make sure that uh, we are able to house all the visitors that we're suddenly getting. All right. Oh, uh -huh. okay, we're making progress. That's nice. Some migrants have arrived, thank goodness. It's only... Oh no, it's midsummer. Oh no, oh no, 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 oh no, oh no. Uh, right, so, um... I'm gonna cut here, because it's over an hour already. And then when we come back, we will, uh... <coughs> probably still suffer the act of not having nearly enough people, because I'm pretty sure this initial... This .init file that I'm using is still locked at 